Good morning, class. Our lesson today is about power tools. Most modern construction or manufacturing applications will likely utilize one or a combination of two power sources, hydraulic and pneumatic. Although specific actuators and lifting devices may operate solely on electricity through a screw system, most applications will involve some form of fluid power. This leaves you with the option of choosing between hydraulics and pneumatics. The distinction between pneumatics and hydraulics is based on the medium used for power transmission. Pneumatics rely on compressible gases, such as air or pure gas. At the same time, hydraulics using compressible liquids like mineral oil, ethylene glycol, water, synthetic fluids, or high temperature resistant fluids to enable power transmission. Common pneumatic tools. 1. Air impact wrenches, powerful tools commonly used for loosening or tightening bolts and nuts with high torque. 2. Pneumatic drill, a handheld air-powered tool that drills holes or destroys hard surfaces such as rock, concrete, and roads. 3. Air Hammer It uses compressed air to drive a hammering piston that delivers repeated impacts to the attached chisel or tool bit. 4. Tire Inflator There are several tire inflators. Some use air pumps, cars and bikes, balls, mattresses, etc. 5. Paint Sprayer Spray painting is another essential application of compressed air. One of the simplest paint sprayers is an airbrush. You can use these sprayers with cars, mural painting, artists, building models, and even t-shirt painting. 4. Air tools make the job easy and fast, whether drilling holes, tightening, loosening nuts slash bolts, demolishing roads, buildings, inflating tires, painting, etc. They are also known as pneumatic tools as they use compressed air as the energy source, in contrast to fuel electricity. We saw the basics of air tools, how they work, and different types of air tools along with their uses. Common Hydraulic Tools Hydraulic Wrench A conventional hydraulic torque wrench kit generally comprises a hydraulic torque wrench, a particular hydraulic pump station for hydraulic torque wrenches, a double high-pressure hose, and a high-strength heavy-duty socket. Hydraulic Jack A jack that uses a plunger or a hydraulic cylinder as a rigid jacking member. Simple lifting equipment is generally only equipped with a lifting mechanism to lift heavy objects. It is simple in structure, light in weight, easy to carry, and easy to move. Hydraulic Fuller This is an ideal new tool to replace traditional fullers. It has a compact structure, flexible use, convenient carrying and operation, fewer restrictions on site, etc. It is suitable for various maintenance places. If the handle slightly swings back and forth, the hydraulic starting lever moves forward, 
the hook claws retreat correspondingly and the object can be pulled out. Hydraulic nut cutters are also called nut cutters. In some industries, for rusted nuts that cannot be disassembled, a nut cutter can be used to cut the bolt without damage to the bolt easily, and the bolt can be used next time. Hydraulic press is a mechanical press that utilizes hydraulic cylinders to generate compression force. It uses the hydraulic equivalent of a mechanical lever, also known as a Brahma press. Hydraulic crimpers are tools used to connect the ends of two cables, wires, or similar flexible materials, such as hydraulic hoses, to match hose ends. The tool allows the user to create a crimp connection through a hydraulic fluid mechanism that transfers force from the user to the tool. Group activity. Think of six power tools, three pneumatic, and three hydraulic tools. Present your work in class. Lesson activity. Identify and classify each one into the corresponding category. Hand tool or power tool. 